The uh, real software usage for the crew on the boat is all about getting information to the guys in a pretty tough situation. These guys, if you can imagine standing in front of a fire hose on the roof of your car while you're driving down the freeway at 55 miles per hour, this is the situation these guys are in and they've got to make a split second decision that could decide the race. Do they tack, do they jive, do they go straight? We've got boundaries around the race course that they need to keep within but they like to go as close as they can, quite often tacking within about five to 10 feet from the boundary. Well, the tactician's position, position four on our boat, has uh, information about the race course on a software tablet. It's talking about the estimation of the ley lines. It's talking about the boundaries, the time, and the distance. So there's a lot of calculations that go into it. There's basically two phases to the software. There's a pre-start phase where we're getting our time and distance to the line organized for us on the software and we just have to confirm it with our eyes. Then once the race starts and we're on the race course, all the information about the location of the marks is entered into the system and then we have information based on our polars relative to ley lines and the boundaries and how many tacks we're going to end up doing. So we have a good plan from the software side that helps us to kind of execute against the other boat on the racetrack. The uh, software we use is all custom written. It's made so that the guys can get a snapshot of where the boat is and the relationship to the race course in one millisecond. So the moment they get a chance to look at it, they can see where they are, they can see what they've got to do, and they can make their decisions as quickly as possible. In Bermuda, our race course is naturally defined by the size of the sound. So we're going to be sailing all the way up and down across the sound, and we're going to use the entire race course to our advantage, but within that, there'll be the electronic boundaries that show up. It'll be well defined once we get enough spectator boats out there. And while we're practicing, it's a little bit hard to see those lines sometimes, but what you guys see on TV is what we see on the box, and we'll get information on the, through the software that gives us that similar look and uh, gives us all the same data. It's a question whether we can use that to our advantage and figure out what the breeze is doing on top of that to put ourselves in a better position to win.